Well, ladies and gentlemen, we're about to go try the six by six some more. I think it's I think it's time to go through a new hole. Right, there's this place we used to go at sometimes, but you only go in it once or twice before it starts uh, becoming a bottomless pit and you just can't make it. So we're gonna go in there today. We're gonna try the six by six out. We might have to try the old winch out. Right now I'm just waiting for Waylon to come because he's gonna drive the X4 and I'm gonna drive the old six tracks. And we'll see what we can get to. If you haven't already, guys, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And we'll see. Yeah, I figured you ride that, I ride this. If I get stuck, you can pull me out. John didn't want to go because of the uh slick because of the uh spiders. Big chicken, you know how it works. Because of the spiders. Spiders. I was like, don't be scared of spiders, they more scared of you. I would have done this yesterday, but I, I but I, yeah, it's what dude, it's when we went in the woods that day, remember? Yeah, no exhaust. Taking in water. Give me the winch. I know what it is. It's the exhaust, dude. The, think about it. the exhaust. Don't have anything. Straight pipe. I'll see it. Bring me, bring me the wet thingy, buddy. <laughs> she floating. You suck it. It's fine. Hey! <laughs> Damn, of course not. Ugh. Pull me out, buddy. Oh, you have my phone. I said, oh crap, I lost my phone. Winch on the Oyama dog. Here we go. Yes, sir. Okay, she's so yanking me in. Try that. Try, try going now. Okay, go. I didn't yield. Oh. Okay, back up.
it's just, I can't find no exhaust pipe right now. It uses no. such little exhaust pipe. Almost down. And whoa. A little more. Bump it. Yes, I just got a gulp of water in the, in the car. That's why I cut off. Oh, that'll do it. Already tried that. Is the lights on? Nope. She has no power. Lost all juice. Huh. Like a Honda. Back to the drawing board. The drooling boot. Drawing. Pull her. Pull her back to the house. Defeat. Again. Defeat. Again. Yet again. Well, actually, no, she was not defeated this time. She walked. I just had other issues. Like, there's no power going anywhere. They ain't got nothing. Not in there, nothing. Okay, guys, update for anybody wondering why it wouldn't start earlier. Let me tell you, oh, has off button on. <laughs> Anyways, the reason why it wouldn't start is because the battery terminal comes slightly loose. I literally come over here. And, let's see if I can make it do it. I can't make it do it now. Anyways, I come over here and it, it didn't feel loose, but I took the screwdriver and literally just turned it one time and it fixed it. Dang it, I, that, that sucks because I could have gone mudding more, but... Hey, it is what it is. We'll hit, we'll hit some mud again. Hey, Waylon. What's up, boys? We tried, and we did pretty good. It actually d uh, did decent today until the uh, we realized that the uh, carb overflow hose has fell off somehow. Don't ask me how, but we got a carburetor full of water right now. So now we get the joy of trying to pull it out. What do you think, Waylon? It's going to be a job. Still got some more quirks we got to work out. Still got to figure out the tension on ordeal. And still got to figure out the solenoid ordeal. Still got a lot of waterproofing to do too. And of course, but hey, did she, did she at least climb that time? She, she climbed. Did. She redeemed herself today. She, she climbed the hill. Today. The two, if, if it weren't for that guy, she would not have made it with this two wheel drive front end. Don't argue with me, guys. The brake thing does not work. We keep trying it and people keep arguing that if you just compress the brakes just right, it will work. Well, it does slightly work, but it does not redeem itself like this thing with the diff lock. So, thanks for watching. If you haven't already, oh, wait. On another note, the Can Am is broke down again. Yes, we broke the front end of the Can Am. So, we got to fix that. The visco, visco lock has gone out. So, we're going to be pulling the diff out, deleting the Visco lock, and putting in a torque locker. So, maybe we won't have those problems anymore. So, we're about to have a real diff on the Can a real lock on the yeah, Can Am. Yeah, we're about to have an axle breaker now. <laughs> well, guys, thanks for watching. If you haven't already, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you on the next one.